controversial, but hi, controversial. Your presence, like actually ask yourself, what does a man need to invest, whether that's monetarily, time wise, creativity wise, effort wise, to get to know you and to be in your company? Like this, like this. Recognize that you are a gift and you are special. I am a gift and I am special. Posted and get treated with bare minimum effort because the women who get princess treatment are no different than you. I'd rather be a ghost. Such a queen. I really do. And because I view myself in high regard, maybe you think I'm crazy. I don't care. I view myself this way. Anyone who comes along who doesn't start courting me like I am a queen, I immediately turned off by I don't care how rich they are, hot they are, amazing, whatever they are. I don't care. So the person that wins you is the one that invests the most in you. That makes you really easy to manipulate if you think about it. Um, and also a lot of men will do this because they're cheap, right? Oh, let's go on a hike. Let's go to coffee. I want to be with a guy like that. That's probably as good as it's going to get. Yeah, I want to be with a guy like that. Because it's not about being cheap. It's about being frugal and being smart with your money. A lot of these men are investing a lot of their money. They're not going to invest in a person that they don't know, a stranger. But yeah, if you're with them long term, they'll be willing to do a little bit more for you. You know, you guys will go on those nicer dates. You guys will go on vacations. It'll become more of a partnership other than this weird transactional thing. If you're a long term person in somebody's life, they're going to be more willing to do nicer things for you. That's just how it works.